Looking for suspects tonight after a local man is shot in the chest and rushed to the hospital. Tonight we're uncovering new details about what happened and learning more about the person who may have pulled the trigger. Eyewitness News reporter Susan Campbell has been working the story all day and she's tracked down a key player in the case. She joins us now with more on our top local story. The victim was rushed here to Rhode Island Hospital, suffering from a gunshot wound to the chest. But the man who called 911 tells me that victim was actually up and walking around before emergency crews and police arrived on scene. Eyewitness news on the scene of a shooting in Pawtucket. We were just walking home and we got to the corner and there was a bunch of cruisers and an ambulance and there was some policemen out on the um, ground looking for something. It happened Wednesday night around 9.30 on Cooper Street. That was something I... Minor Chacon says he woke up to the scary scene because his neighbor, Diego Rodriguez, was banging on his door, pleading for help. He was bleeding. He got his hand in his chest. So he was saying, I'm shot, I'm shot. Chacon immediately called 911. Police tell us Rodriguez was shot once in the chest, but the 30-year-old is expected to be okay. He was, like, shaking all the time. Nerves was back and forth, and he said, sit down. They tell you, sit down. Until finally, he realized that he was getting dizzy, so he sat down on the stairs. Police tell us the shooter ran from the scene. They say he was wearing all black clothing. So far, police have not made any arrests in this case. With the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.